What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, in this video, we're gonna show you how to repin your connector for your EGT sensor if it should happen to get pulled out on your RaceMe Ultra or MM3 programmers. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So um, we had our EGT, we've already got it repinned. Um, so we'll cut into actually pinning it in the process. We ended up having to order uh, some of these um, crimpers for the, I think they call them open barrel uh, connectors. So they look kind of like this. One part of that gets crimped down on the insulation. This part at the very end gets crimped on the, on the insulation of the wire. And the other part gets crimped down um, at the top between the wire. Um, so it'll actually come down and form like a hook like this and take half of the wire on the left side and half on the right. <clears throat> so we ordered uh, these crimp connectors off of Amazon, or the uh, crimpers off of Amazon. They're for uh, barrel connectors 32 to 20 uh, gauge. And this is kind of what they, what they look like here. You can see how they kind of um, spring open, but you can see how they crimp on either side. So you'll put the connection in here and it'll crimp it down as such, um, giving you a nice clean, clean crimp and a tight crimp. Um, what you want to be aware of though is if you don't have these, you'll see it in the video, we didn't have these at first. Um, so we ended up stripping the wire with our, our strippers here um, because it's so small and then we inserted it here and just kind of bent it down with our pliers on either side. Um, so it doesn't have that hook, but it still worked. So um, then these these have little tabs on them here. You can see a little tab at the very back, if it'll focus. So you can see the tab there. These push in and those tabs lock into this spot here. So you can see them right there, how they lock in. If you want to release these, um, you pretty much just, you can probably take like a little screwdriver, push down on it and pull on the back side of the wire and they'll pop loose. Um, the configuration for this, if you had yours pulled out, I had to call, uh, call over to the company to make sure I had it pinned out correctly for the programmer. So this is the direction that your uh, wires need to go. So white, green, black, red with the tabs facing up. So that's the direction that it needs to be pinned out in. So anyways, let's get to the video and I uh, hope you guys enjoy the video. All right, so that's gonna do it for um, repinning your EGT sensor um, connector to your MM3 power 
um, programmer or race me ultra or race me ultra programmer um, if you like this video please hit that subscribe button and the like button uh, give us a thumbs up and uh, be sure to stay tuned for uh, upcoming content thanks again we appreciate it